I came to Convocation because I think anytime that they bring someone to campus to speak who has worthwhile life experience, it's so easy to go and it's a free ticket and everyone should go and hear what they have to say. And I'm so glad that I did because they were very interesting. I came to Convocation because I like to support the academic climate at Elon. I thought it was a great opportunity I wouldn't miss it for the world. And I read an article that Nicholas Kristof and Cheryl Wudong wrote about a year ago and it was interesting to see them in person after reading that article. I enjoyed Convocation because I've seen their documentary Half the Sky before and I have a real interest in poverty because of one of my honor students is about this. So I wanted to see their perspective and just see them face to face because they are really talented, famous people. So it's a good experience. No, I didn't really have any expectations. Um, the only thing is that I've read a few of Kristoff's uh, opinion columns and they touched a lot more on fundraising and uh, giving money than I thought they were going to. I thought they were going to talk more on world issues and things going on and their opinions on it, especially Kristoff because he's an opinion writer. So uh, yeah, definitely not what I expected. But what I loved was how much action they promoted. Um, and how most of their talk is really rooted in encouraging action and not just encouraging education and discussion. Because discussion only does so much without action, it's pointless. I totally agree with them how it's not it's all not always about money, it's always about opportunity as well. And that's a big issue that hopefully um, my generation and myself as well can try to figure out in the future. It was really touching to see um, just the whole perspective of the world, seeing people impacted in Columbia to people impacted in Boston and how it really is a global problem. So made me think a little bit deeper about what you can do at home and it's not always just uh, abroad. So. His point about the drop in the bucket being really important, that's like something everyone needs to know, you know? Because like, like you said, like the drop in the bucket doesn't seem important, but it is important. Elon, we have a lot of great privileges here, so it's important to have perspective about what else people are experiencing. One person actually helped his father come to the country and then that helped him give back to other people. So I really thought that really helped change my mind about volunteering and things like that. Well I know Elon's really focused on service and community and stuff like that so I feel like if people here can take the message with them and kind of spread it around it can create a ripple effect and uh, help out the world as a whole.